I'm your Vice President for Skebby. I just want to say I hope you all had a wonderful festival period and a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. So just to give you a quick update on the things that I've been working on in the last few weeks. Um, main thing is Feel Fab February. So Feel Fab Feb is back and is a whole month of online activities and events ran by us at the Students Association and our clubs, societies and groups. We also have videos from our volunteers at the Students Association just speaking about their volunteering experience and how volunteering makes you feel good because you're doing something that you're passionate about. Another thing that I've been working on is refreshers. Obviously I was the refreshers lead and it was great to be a part of. We welcomed so many new students and we had great events such as drag bingo. We had a GC Wolves pub quiz and we had loads of mindfulness events as well. And lastly, we welcomed loads of new students to the International Welcome Talk and the International Welcome Night hosted by myself and student president Susie D. So it's great to meet so many new students and we hope you have a great time here at DCU. Hi everyone, I hope you're all doing all right. Uh, my name is Tabitha and I'm the Vice President for the School of Health and Life Sciences. And I just wanna give a warm welcome to all our new students who started with us in January. Welcome to the GCU family and to all our continuing students, all the best as you continue with your studies with us. And I'm also just here to give you a short update about some of the things that I've been working on. So I'm currently working on my individual objectives. And uh, if you don't know what those are, you can find them on our website, as well as a video that we did on our GC Student Association YouTube. And if you want more information, do feel free to get in touch with me um, on them. Uh, apart from that, I'm also doing training on uh, decolonizing the curriculum and just working in partnership with the university to continue on works to do with that, as well as looking forward for PhilFab Feb that's being organized by our VP for Skibi, and that's Zoe Nicholson. So have a look out for that and look at it through our social medias, both from the Students Association and the Students Offices. Uh, all the best through the academic year and do take care of yourself and remember to be good to yourself. Uh, have a lovely academic year. Hi everyone, hope you're all getting used to being back in class and everyone's doing okay. So to keep this brief, I thought I would give you five bullet points on some of the things that I have been working on to represent your academic interests. Number one, election nominations are open. You still have time to get your name in to be elected as either student president or one of the vice presidents. I've created an election video on the top 10 reasons why you should run for elections. You can check it out at the Students Association Facebook page. Number two, I hosted Ask the Officer Live on the Student Association social media with special guest Matt Crilly, who is the NUS Student President for Scotland, where we discussed a range of issues affecting students. Again, to check it out, same as before, on our social media. Number three, to all student issues after the new year to the exec board to find solutions and post it on social media. There's also a blog with feedback on the Students Association website, gcustudents.co.uk. Any other issues that you have, you let your VPs know as soon as possible and we can work on your behalf to resolve them. Number four, we welcomed our international students and myself and Zoe Nicholson, who is the VP of Skebe, hosted an induction talk in January as well as the International Students Quiz and it was so nice to see all you guys from all over the world. And number five, I co-wrote a presentation on tackling racism at GCU with Tabsa Yurike, VP of SHLS and I presented this at the GCU Court Strategy Day on behalf of Tabsa and the Students Association. Tabsa is part of the GCU Tackling Racism Group and that's just a wee brief on what I've been up to and to see more you can click on my face or the VP's faces on the Students Association website and it will show you a full list of all our reports. Take care, stay safe.